Yes, I was muted and I was testing you. I swear exactly that's what it was. Um, no, I was exactly saying just that, that uh, I've survived, I'm back to this, work has been a thing, and uh, I'm a little bit rusty at this, so this should be fun, because I'm not used to this anymore. Uh, perfect example is the fact that I didn't unmute myself, so good times ahead, I'm sure today's stream will be full of jank, so it is what it is. We already have a Goya, because... I can't start a stream without Goya, so we'll start, kick off to the cat cam, give that two or three minutes, and then we will get started with the game. And then we'll y'all talk about what that is while, uh, while we're going. Oof, that is too hot. Come on back, bud. So, what we will be playing is 3D.GameHeroes, which is a PS3 game that most normal people have not played, uh, because it is... A Zelda-ish game throwback before throwbacks became really popular. Yes, so you. And honestly, most folks haven't played this, but... Um, it was made by From Software, the folks that made Demon Souls, Dark Souls, and all of that. This was before that really kicked off, and they really hadn't established their brand, per se. Um, so this is a fun little throwback, but it's cool in a lot of ways, because other than just being pretty... Um, playing with the cubes and stuff like that prior to Minecraft being a big thing uh, and being shiny it lets you build your own character if you feel so inclined and you'll see shortly maybe you can see in the top corner but um, the weapons are absurd so like you can get a giant sword that is the entire size of the screen you can get a giant fish that you use as a weapon um, it's just a bunch of nonsense but more or less it is a 3D vacation yep that's the camera Goya uh, of the original Legend of Zelda on NES, so. Apparently he is not bored with me, so we can get back to the game again. So I did play through this, but it was forever ago, so I do not recall much about it. Um, so basically it'll just be a new game again. Which can be good or bad, TBD on that. Let me just change one thing with the camera. Bum, 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 bum. I'm gonna like zoom in a little bit. I don't know if that's a little bit. Yeah, why not? Good enough. But, um. Hey, Pocky. Appreciate everyone's patience while I was away for work, so thank you for the resubs, uh, Miss Liza and Pocky. Um, thank you for the subs, and I guess we'll just start playing and hopefully have a good time. Liza. Yeah, uh, Seth, Liza, Liza. That's not how that song goes. <laughs> uh, I don't know what you're talking about, Melody Avis. <laughs> alright. <laughs> uh, alright. But good evening, hi and hello. Welcome, Pocky. Welcome, um, Miss Lisa. A few of my snapshots. I shouldn't have any. I don't remember if I... Okay, no, I do not. Because I do not have my original PS3 anymore. But yeah, so kind of a fun thing with this, like I was mentioning, is you can create a character. <laughs> uh, Lisa will be... Uh, she will give high fives for that. Select a gender. My gender is Prince. Mm -mm. <laughs> no, no. I didn't realize that Dreams is now in your title. That was new. Oh, wow. This is weird. Alright, we are definitely not messing around with the creative character. Miss Lissa? Miss Liss? It's like Swiss Miss. I remember that now. Miss Lissa. Christmas, and that's a Goya. Uh, so he's yelling at me too. So don't worry, you were you're in good company. He's got your back. So I'm just double checking. We do have the screen actually up and running, and I'm not muted. We are like 30% to not being jank, so this is fantastic. But I have a lot of characters to pick from. From Sonya. We got some rogue-looking guys, a dwarf, a samurai, 
Mary, not Maru. Uh, Santa and Santa Funk. The Santa has wintry style and funk in this stuff. Dragon, assassin, what else do we got? Oh, I can be a car? Okay. A shark, hero, president. The X seventh president of the United States who has gone missing. Caveman, <laughs> manager. A uh, businessman who will save the world so he can plan his retirement. That's fantastic. Shishio? Lone Leonin? Warrior? No, that's not a mask. Ranger? A actual tank. Racer? Boncho? Sporting awesome. Do this Boncho calls the Dark King a Shibazo? Oh my goodness. Okita? Shinsugumi. I what is this a mech? Sure. Rikamaru Pucci. Tashu, Rin, Ayami, Smithy, Soldier, Skeleton, Magi. Wow, they're I don't remember there being this many. I wonder if they um patched in some more. Succubus, Witch, Alien, Boxer, Ninja. From below ground ground. Breeze through a snorkel. I can be a gorilla. King, Robo King, Vampire Pumpkin. Are any of these standing out for anyone? It could be Frank, who is... Oh, sure, for Frankenstein. Antisocial man who communes with animals in the mountains. Might have a jackpot here. Give me the weird old man. Shippu, Striker, Arcade Hero, Ascii, Blue Screen of Death, what the hell? Big Cluckin, Beholder, Bok Bok, Brawl, Brimley, Bunblade, Calories, when things go wrong in Dotnia, you know who to blame. Shaddy, Cobra, Cosplayer, Evil Mantra, Manta, Death Skull, Cowgirl, Floaty, Kit, Happy Hummer. Jitsu, Joystick, Blame me. Oh my goodness, they really do have a lot. Manon. Half man, half tank, all manon. <laughs> oh, that's fantastic. Pangamek, Phoenix. Rad Nanner? It's a skateboarding banana. Ratman, Red Eye, Roller Team. Taco Man. Half eaten Taco Man. Well, that's just rude. Spike, Sheep Suit, Templar, Thrust. A Mick Viper is one of many prototypes. Tiny Woman. Big Adventure. All it ever wanted was a kiss. Uh, Tortuga, Vampira, Venice, or Venus. It's a flytrap. Wheels, Handicap, Never Stop a Hero, and Sackboy. TM. So. Do we have any heroes that stand out for anyone? Boom. 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 Mm. Like, I'm all in on Ridiculous, but at the same time, I'm going to be hanging out with this character for a couple hours. the weird old man wherever that guy went. Maybe I'm gonna go with him. Hi, Goya. Wild man. Anti-social man who communes with animals. I don't know what the scholar means, so we'll find out. I wonder if that changes my my weapons. Yeah, there's, there's a bit of Goya going on. He's being super demanding of my time right now, and I don't know what I did. Ah. Good job, Miss Lissa. We're enjoying some liquid death again tonight. I have a small box of this in the fridge, so... Cheers. Everyone hydrate. It's Monday night, start of the week, so I'm feeling water should be in order for a lot of people. But you do you. Whatever sounds tasty right now. In the distant past, a small land 
called Dotnia Kingdom prospered. And there was a going away. Uh, this piece was upheld by the six magical orbs and their six guardian sages. Water indeed. How uh, about the Dark King? Coveted power, he captured the sages and hid the orbs. Evil monsters besieged the kingdom, but just when hope was lost, Goya blocked whatever is on the screen. A young man with a sacred sword arrived to rescue the six sages. What a gentleman. Each sage empowered with uh, youth with their orbs, and the light orb was formed. In the fierce battle that followed, when the youth pierced the Dark King... Dun, 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 dun. Excuse me. Uh, the light orb shined, trapping him inside a pulsing dark orb. Youth was hailed as a hero, and tales of his bravery spread. Yay! The kingdom prospered, and the story brought visitors from afar. A feeling this peace did not last. But the tale of the brave hero faded into myth. As the kingdom lost its charm, the visitors from other lands dwindled. Oh, they're all 2D. Where did everybody go? King Tezro launched an inquiry, seeking answers. It came clear to him. People had lost interest in 2D worlds. And so... Dot, dot, dot. Poof. The king boldly declared... This is an age of 3D. Reform began and hope dawned that the kingdom was upgraded to 3D. Nope. The king's plans were interrupted by disturbing news. Dark Orb was stolen by Fuel, a dark bishop with an evil plan. <laughs> As monsters filled the fields again, people could only pray for the emergence of a young hero like the one of legend. Enter Wild Man. Or load screens. A lot of dots. Dark King is sealed but not slain. Calamity may strike. Ah, uh -huh, Calamity again and again. Uh, our kingdom again one day. I must leave the sword in the sacred forest in case that comes to pass. The forest north of the castle, the sword will be preserved. North, sacred forest, west, Rajak village. See, look at that ginormous awesome sword. And you can spin with it. <laughs> oh, good times. That bunny actually wasn't doing anything. I don't know why I felt like murdering it. Or maybe they are coming after me. Okay. I feel less awful about it. It might be slight overkill with that ginormous sword, though. Oh, is this a boss arena? Oh, no! I know that one day Brave Soul will claim it and overcome all evil. Yeah, this this wall's a wear... This wears its Zelda on its sleeve. Long live Dotnia. Keep her. Wake up. Wake up, sleepyhead. Oh, yeah. Good morning. Did you sleep well last night? You had a strange dream. Is it a dream about a hero who defeated a dark king? Monsters have been aggressive lately, but I wouldn't doubt. Or I would doubt it. Uh, true heroes dream in 3D. So that's how you can really tell. words. Uh, excuse me, I understand someone named Wild Man is here. <laughs> oh, uh, you've committed a crime or something? 
Not to my knowledge. Oh, so you're wild man. Come with me. The king requests your presence at the castle. This is definitely not Tears of the Kingdom. Should be a good time, though. Thank you for coming, wild man. Our kingdom is great peril once again. Mm, you should have... You have seen the world, so I must ask a favor of such a famed scholar. The hero who saved our kingdom left his sword in the northern forest. I believe you are the one who can pull the sword from its stone. If so, you are destined to save our kingdom. The problem is, no one has actually found the sword to this very day. But you are a scholar of wisdom and experience. I know you can do it. Will you venture north of the castle to obtain the legendary sword? I'll consider it. You are a great scholar, dear Wildman. Thank you for your bravery. It's so dangerous to go alone. Take this. To be alone. Take this. Got a sword. Got a shield. It's so shiny in here. Have faith that you are the hero of legend. Yeah. What is money you got? A whole lot of nothing. Got a sword. I got strength, spin, pouring, or hearing sword. Fairies. Looks like orbs go there. Life shards are apples. And that's that. Okay. Yeah, I look forward to going through this again because I haven't had a PS3 in a good long while. And this is one of those the few games that are absolutely stuck on that generation. Um, specifically, like, it didn't come out on Xbox or PC or anything like that, so... Definitely one of those that is just trapped here forever. And I don't think I've had a working PS3 since... Just, um, I don't know, a literal decade at this point? Maybe, maybe a little less. Because I want to say PlayStation 4 came out in 2013, and I did not have it at that point. Ah, Fairy Fountain. And beyond that, like actually getting my hands on this game again was a bit of a pain in the butt. As one, finding it somewhere at a store. I didn't. I don't like buying stuff online just because I don't trust the, um, the quality that it's going to be in. I usually don't trust the people who are sending it either. Been burned more than once uh, over time from people that are supposed to ship stuff and they just don't. Or they ship the wrong thing. This looks like a game I'd be awful at too. <laughs> oh, it's not that bad. Something charges at you, you hit a button. I think you're selling yourself short. I think you'd be fantastic at it. Uh, if you've played any other Zelda games, I think... Actually, you're better at Breath of the Wild than I am, so I think, I think it's fair to say that you'd be able to handle this. Whether or not it interests you is something entirely different. Uh, because everyone is better than me at Breath of the Wild. <laughs> That's how I know that. Stop jumping around. <laughs> I actually had, um, in my... Oh, Goya, you were literally making the microphone spike, Goya. Yes, use your bombs. Uh, in my D&D group, we were trying to explain to one of the new players just how bad I was at, um, Breath of the Wild, and I was like, hey, I play it bad. They're like, how do you play a game badly? I was like, it's on YouTube, I assure you, anything I should be doing, I'm not doing, therefore, I'm playing it bad. 
and then I informed them that I was so bad that I had to make an emote called Use Your Bomb, um, because chat wanted to throttle me. Uh, I believe that Beachy said that she was yelling at her TV at that point, because of all the things I should be doing, I was doing zero of them. So it's a good time. Old sword stuck deep inside its stone base. Pull it out. I have plucked the sword from the stone. And it is very furry. It's furrier than I intended, but... Oh, please don't cut me. Please. Are you going to be calm? Oh, God. I don't know what he hit, but something made noises. I'm still alive, though, so that's good. Alright, got Ancient Sword. Cats are like liquid. It's very dangerous. Wow! The true hero has finally emerged! Oh, apologies. My name is Lee. I've been waiting for you. That's all I'm doing with that voice. Uh, please tell me your name, great hero. <laughs> hmm, wild man. <laughs> Where have I heard that name? <laughs> Wait, you're from, uh, you're the famous scholar of Wild Man, aren't you? I read the, read the thesis that you published on save data? Very interesting. I just know that you're the one who will save the world, Master Wild Man. <laughs> uh, but the road you walk on is a dangerous one. That's why I wish, uh, to accompany you. I swear I'll be useful. No. I disagree. Lee, join the party. Let us return to the king with proof that you are a hero. Mm -mm -mm. Big sword. There's no way they're letting me keep this thing. Oh, my dude looks so funny. I'm happy and sad with my decision to go with Wild Man. Apple. I didn't even realize I have a map in the top right corner because that's where the cat cam is mounted on the monitor. Um, so how is your Tears of the Kingdom going so far? Have you uh, gotten accustomed to it yet? Are you Have you found your mojo? Oh, I always blame the cat. It's easier. <laughs> Plus, he's gonna yell at me anyway, so I might as well just, um, at least give him a reason to yell at me. Like, if I'm gonna get in trouble, I'm just gonna own it. Found Rito Village. Oh, those asshole birds? Well, I guess Revali's dead, so that's good. So he shouldn't be as much of an asshole. Mm -mm. And you know that I realized to walk around the locked door. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, that's crazy how, you know, 3D spaces work. I'm not one to judge because you've seen me play and how poorly it goes. So I'm definitely going to be waiting until people can yell at me the correct way to play Tears of the Kingdom before I start to play Tears of the Kingdom. Ooh, I can use my sword indoors. How rude. I have a glider. I thought there just wasn't a glider in this game. <laughs> oh, that would dramatically change everything if there was no glider. Alright, what you got, King? This is Sword of Legend. Indeed, a true hero. Now, listen carefully. Onyx, the Dark King, has brought a dark age upon the kingdom, but the hero, with the aid of the Six Sages, sealed him inside a dark orb, and now that dark orb has been stolen. Thief's name is Fuel. Deeming himself a dark bishop, he believes he can wield the orb, and with Onyx's power, he plans on taking over the entire world. The only way to stop him is with the six legendary orbs of the Six Sages. I beseech you, wild man. Please find the six orbs and the six sages to bring peace to the land. Yes. Ah, wild man. I knew I should. Ah, uh, you would shoulder this burden. Thank you. See your vast wisdom and the source of your confidence. Six orbs are located in the six aging temple temples 
throughout the kingdom. First, head to the grass temple to the west. You can do it, wild man. Oh, cool, I do. I guess I do get to keep this absurd sword. See, uh, I just thought with all the new functions, they got rid of it. No, that makes sense. Um, because I mean, what if if I, I haven't really looked at much about like what's going on in that game, but I imagine if they kept everything the same as far as like the world and the layout of the cities and stuff like that, that if you just had the same mobility, um, if you really, I don't know, it would not feel new. So, forcing you to use new ways to traverse that world, i.e. removing your fancy little glider, um, seems like a good way to get people on board with exploring it differently. So, I, I can definitely... that tracks. And, I mean, I'm the guy who didn't understand that bombs are to be used, um, ever. So, I'm definitely not one to judge when, uh, tools are not being utilized. Do -do -do -do. Do -do -do -do. Um, I don't actually know how long this game is. I don't remember. Mysterious wall for money and good things may come. 20 G per try. Throw some money in? Yes. Got 10 arrows. Okay. Yeah, and even like after the joke of, hey, use your bombs had been repeated multiple times, I still still did not remember to use my bombs. Rayjack Village. You can register your revival point by staying at the inn. Oh, I forgot, not all games have like, auto-revive. Or checkpoints. So I gotta remember to save. That's probably, going back to old games, probably one of the, the weirder things to remember. So I'm so used to everything doing auto-saves all the time. So having to remember to actually manually save now and then is just hard to remember. Uh, I think a 3D mech game would be a blockbuster. Would you play it? Sure. Need a room? It's 5G. Good night. Good morning. Revival points set. <sighs> Alright, so they outlined that I have six dungeons to go to. I wonder if there will be any curveballs in there, too, but... Monsters to, uh, make it hard to leave town. Stoggy is friendly. Maybe he thinks it's human. Whimper, whimper. That's not a happy dog. Uh, potions. It's much harder to clean up in 3D. Too much is visible now. This game might be, might be a, a smidge tongue-in-cheek. Welcome to my store. Red apple, red potion, restores all life, green apple, magic. <laughs> restores all magic for magiholics. <laughs> uh, like, the joke is very simple, but I just like the word magiholic. Uh, restores all life, but not in temples. Candle made for a frugal. Variety pack. Great for caves. Wait, so does light burn out? Because that's really annoying if that's the case. I'll buy one and then I'll regret it later. That I did not buy more. Buy a sleeping bag just to be safe. And I'll wait. I'm not quite a magiholic yet. Um, okay. Do, 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 do. Now, it's Cyberpunk, uh, that is a game where I've abused all of the said magic. Granted, it's uh, technology, but man, that game was a lot of fun to be a dirty little hacker and fight from a range. Here, there's a sword north of the castle. Yeah? I'll uh, find a temple uh, in the grass to the west. Yes, I'm heading there. I thought I'd set by town to see if there's anything I should know. Want to see some magic. Ham, Nepo, to... Then, sir. So press L1 to open map. Spell... Ah, oh, that's a fancy map. I like it. It's easy to not get lost, then. I dig it. Blacksmith can strengthen swords. Have you seen him yet? 
No, I have not. I am new to town. Want to know the infinity money code? Yeah, right. Earn it yourself. Bite me. Meow? Yes, Goya is in fact meowing. It's possible to get rare items from wells in some towns. What do we got here? Oh, your statues. Well, I'd love to let you play your dash circuit game, but see, I can't. Because I'm about to ace the thing, so come back soon, will ya? Welcome. Ooh, iron shield. And they're really pushing these light sources, so... That is not gonna be good. He's more than meowing. He's... Uh, I can't... I can't make him happy right now because he just wants to live outside, and I can't let him live outside. So, he's upset that that is... That I am not letting him live outside. How do I change my shield? Welcome to the chat room. Did my stream break for a second? I'm gonna be pissed if it did. Because I am hardwired in at this point. Is my sh oh, I'm an idiot. I don't have to equip my shields. It's just equipped. That's just weird. Um, normally on the stream labs that I use, um, the OBS, whenever I have a service disruption, it, it pops up with "Welcome to the chat room," and it just popped up. So it's concerned, but I'm like, dude, I'm hardwired in. Like, no more jank. I've had enough jank tonight. Oh, uh, swords have maximum potential for upgrading. Think before you act. Forger sword to carry now, what would you like? I can... Tav Pierce. Alright, so I have length, width, strength, spin, beam, pierce, special. Quite a few different things to work on. Alright, but I also have no money because I got my shield and a camping bag and a torch. Or, um... Lantern. Oh, how come I can't walk that way? There we go. Have you invented... Have you met an inventor named Dick? Uh, don't get sucked into his schemes. Cool. Hi. <laughs> I'm an inventor. Named Dick. I heard about you. Say so you don't want to try out my latest creation, call them Dash Boots. Let's do it. I just realized Dick is Sid backwards, so it's Final Fantasy. They're just not being uh, crass. Dash Boots completed. Get your weapons ready. Get equipped with Dash Boots. Yay! Sid is the inventor in all of the Final Fantasy, starting with, I believe, Final Fantasy 3? Could be wrong on that one. He's definitely at least in 4, back on Super Nintendo. Oh, I always wanted to do that, thanks. Now you can press uh, square to dash. Oh, that's interesting. I was not expecting a giant sword to pop out of me when I dashed. Don't know why. Clearly, that's what happens in the real world. Whenever I run, a giant sword pops out. Hum, Bluesy the Slime. I dream of becoming a human someday. You should work on that. Uh, as a human, I one day dream of becoming a blue slime, so. Grass is greener, sir. Uh, dark towers always veiled in thick fog. What if it thickens and covers our village, too? Magic mirror was lost in a poisonous bog. That sounds useful. And where is my sister? And let's right through her fingers. Story of my life. Hey, you there. Are you sh the hero I've heard so much? Sure. I can tell by the sight of you. The wild man. I can sense a great destiny in you. Can I read your fortune? It's on the house. I'm giving your hand. See, bright light shining inside of you. Hmm. Aren't the hero I'm looking for. 
Speaking of, I do want to buy some tarot cards. Because I've... I've been, for whatever reason, having a hunch of... Like, I want to play around with some. Um, and get familiar with reading. Don't know why I feel drawn to it right now, though. And I do not... I have not had tarot cards in two decades. It's been a while. Goya? Do you want something? I'm going to be right back. I'm going to give him some treats to see if I can bribe him to chill a little bit. Instead of, you know, everyone just calling, you know, animal abuse hotlines on me during the stream. Because that is going on. So I will be right back. I'm going to try and feed Goya something other than his wet food. And we'll see if that sticks. Or maybe I'll drug him with catnip. Who's to say? But, uh, BRB... Okie dokie. Uh, cats are fed. Took the opportunity for another ad. But, or, sorry. Um, I've given them treats. So we'll see how that goes. Don't choose me and the only girl worthy, worthy of being his wife. No, choose me. We've been friends our entire lives. I'm getting married. But who should I choose? My childhood friend or the daughter of a wealthy family? I'm so torn. I was leaning towards childhood friend. But I've got to be honest. I like the rich girl spell set better. Who should I choose? My childhood friend? No. So you to choose the rich girl then? Yes. Dollar dollar bills, y'all. Ah, I knew that'd be the right choice. Thanks. Only girl worthy of being his wife. That's funny. Like legit worth. 
So, like, they didn't hear me or they just don't actually decide? I made up my mind, thank you. Sorry, Sugar Mama wins out. It's hard to argue, argue with money. It's the quality of life you're gonna get there. Dun, dun, dun. Travel the world, my adventure days. If I was a bit younger, I could save Donna. I bet. No, what? Really? Drama. Empty bottle. Okay. This game seems very wholesome. Which is very different from the last game I was playing, where I was a, um, serial... No, no, sorry, I wasn't a serial... Well, I guess I am a serial killer, because I was murdering a lot of people. Oh, sorry, chicken. Um, but I had psychic abilities, and there was horror, and people were chasing after me, and I may or may not have worked for the government. Um, yeah, that game was just a lot more dark than this. Do, 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 do. Okay. Alright, we should be able to at least hopefully finish a dungeon tonight. Ah, adventure music is back. I do like that things are exploding into tiny little blocks. Got a small block, okay. It is wild that a game like this can be made that is, like, so clearly a ripoff. Uh, but somehow it just doesn't matter. Like, even the enemies literally just look like the creature from, uh, the first Legend of Zelda on Nintendo. Like, those look like Bokoblins or whatever they are now. So is this the first dungeon? Hmm? Ooh. Definitely got some temple vibes. Master Wildman, the door leading further is closed. There must be some hidden gimmick somewhere. Like that button? Done it again, wow. Notice the switch, your wisdom is beyond compare, Master. The world we're after must be deeper inside, let's go. So maybe that's a teleport back. Max something. Alright, I guess we go left. Uh-oh. Like, it's just weird because I've got this ginormous sword that they're not coming anywhere near me. Oh, and I can pick up money with it? Interesting. Wild Man is here to tear it up. Dun, 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 dun. See, hmm? see switch on the other side, but how do we push it? Only oh, had something that could hit that button. Like a bow? Can't my giant sword hit it? No. Got a key. Got your toe. Different shell. I think I might have satisfied the Goya. Shit, I shouldn't have said his name. I think the uh, black fluffy void is content. Seems to be so far at least. So that's all good. Good in the hood. Oh, come on. And in the back of my mind, I'm thinking that this is the same 
same developer that makes Dark Souls, so there's no way to... Oh, my sword is tiny now. I didn't know that. I guess at full health it's ginormous. Well, shit. That definitely changes things. But yeah, I got my big sword back. Okay, cool. Good to know. Don't have a key, so... Map. Um, but yeah, I keep on thinking it's made by the people who made Dark Souls, so I'm always expecting something to go awful. There's blocks, block my chest. Perhaps we can push the blocks out of the way. Perhaps. What a novel idea. Um, but none stand out, so... Oh! Never mind, the top has a symbol on them. I guess they do stand out if I use my eyes. Got a key. We are the champions. Enemies don't respawn either. Interesting. Can't expect some sheep shield to block magic beams. Is your amazing evasion to dodge them? Oh, I thought they meant, like, the damn scorpion shot lasers, damn it. Okay, yeah, even my silver shield doesn't do anything. Good to know. God damn it, fairy. Oh, uh, Master Wildman, check it out. Switch on the wall, why don't we try and press it? Because I want to kill things first. Gets my, my apples up. But not enough. Okay. Oh. And it does not look oh I can push the top one. Use your bombs. Boomerang. Whoosh. Shrek foes from afar, can briefly stun. Cool. I'm much better at this than I am at Breath of the Wild. Yeah, I'm worried about Tears of the Kingdom. That game looks so freaking open. From everything I've seen about it. Come on. Alright, got another key. Nothing else in here. And I don't have any apples or potions. the audio just a little bit. Try 38. <laughs> Hopefully you can hear the, the game at a nice comfortable level. Trying to once again get all the stream set up back to where it needs to be. And apparently enemies do respawn if you go far enough. Not that bad as in should be louder. And surviving is a dream of mine. It may or may not occur. A map. I don't. I'm literally looking at the top screen from the map like it's supposed to be there. Oh, Tears of the Kingdom. I don't know. I've seen some crazy ass contraptions that are continuing to be made. I mean, I've also seen nonsense like people recreate a. Uh, 9-11 of flying a plane into two uh, wooden box towers that they made. So, um, yeah, people are out of control. Gamers got no respect, I tell you. We're all a bunch of monsters. Ah! No! Gotta get better at that spin attack. Seems like that'd be useful. 
See, I do not have any keys, correct? Correct, okay. I want my big sword back. Makes me feel so Ooh, that boomerang flies. Dog got some hearts. Bullshit. Oh, God bless! No, no. You are a bunch of dirty bastards. Eee! Oh. God, no. I have half an apple. Oh, my sword is so tiny now. That's no good. Don't want to die. Apple? Ooh, not an apple. A cat key. And a hydrate. Open the boss room door. Cool. And I don't have normal keys. Shit. I was reckless. Now I'm scared to do anything. Yes, Apple. Come on, you bastard. Feeling. Okay. Oh, damn it. Ah, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, I guess I didn't have to do that. Or did I? No, I did not. Um, yeah, I've been all the other rooms. Now, it's actually kind of hard slash annoying to line up in the 3D space to hit things. Uh, glory shines upon thee who banishes darkness. Small brick, whatever those are for. So having a thought with this, like everyone by everyone, I mean me. I just prefer saying everyone, so I don't feel left out or, or isolated. But um, everyone always talks about like wanting just like an old Zelda but done new which is what this is but then I'm thinking about like once you've done this like you think you want that but then everyone and their mother which is not me ever well I guess technically it is me but uh, everyone and their mother then picks up Tears of the Kingdom for being new Zelda like proper new Zelda very different nothing like the Zeldas before it so maybe Nintendo knows what it's doing Because I do want to say before, like when this came out, so this is, this game is circa 2009. Remember the, at the entrance? Yeah, I know. Um, so this is 2009. So if we were to look back at Zelda at that time, that means this is after Twilight Princess came out. But before Skyward Sword. And I think uh, Twilight Princess disappointed a ton of people. 
Uh oh. Snack. Big snack. Big door. No, dude, I was drinking water. Bad snack. Ooh. Must have noticed, Master, but it has a weak spot. It's obviously it's the tail. So strike it from behind. I'm working on it. <laughs> Sorry. I'm laughing because this is like the freaking phone snake game. Yep. Thankfully, he doesn't need apples and get bigger, though. He does speed up, though. You fucker. Come on. There we go. Yeah! No! And, uh, oh, now he's really fast. Stop trying to kill me. I just want to be friends. And chop off all your little bits. But, you know, whatever. Become a weak spot. Oh, I guess it just is a weak spot. Monies! I love when I kill things and they explode into money. And a new apple. Life up. Oh, there's a person living back here. Hey there. Did you and your fairy friend just defeat that snake? Master Wildman's swordplay is remarkable. Of course we beat it. But could you be one of the six sages, sir? Indeed I am. I am Sage Indy of the Grassy Plains. I was reckless, captured by an evil uh, captured by evil as I protected the orb. But thanks to you two, I am safe from harm. Well the king asked me to find the orb, so here we are. My stars. The legacy of the legendary hero. I sense true confidence. He must be a scholar of great renown. That's right, Sage Indy. Master Wildman is destined to save us. Indeed, I sense hope in your eyes. Here, take this orb with you. Thank you, old man. You got Dragon Ball. Yellow orb. Contains magic greater than any magic one could find in 2D. Task we sages is to entrust these magical orbs to a hero. Magic of the yellow orb is yours. Bearer of the hero's mark. Cool. What does yellow do? Shader magic parallax. Magic will reveal hidden floor clues and the tabula rasa tablets. However, its use is limited by location. Cast it wherever you suspect that greater meaning it lies hidden. Hero, go and obtain the rest of the orbs for the peace of our kingdom. The rest of the sages will teach you the magic of the orbs. Thank you, Sage Indy, but where should we head to next? Mm, forest Temple. To the northwest, you'll find the Forest of No Return. Though, sorry, through those cursed wo woods, 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 uh, you will find the Forest King Temple. Northwest, thanks again, let's go. Good, be counting on you two. Have you noticed the E mark in the equipment of your menu? You can press the square button to equip or remove these items from your item reel. You want to be efficient when you use L2 or R2 to cycle through items, yes? Try removing items you don't typically use for faster cycling. Oh, that's fun. Very fun, so I don't have to go through a menu or anything. Revive the boss? No. I mean, I guess if I want to farm money? Why would you want to revive the boss? The whole point of a boss is killing it. Mm. Oh, what a shiny world. Well, if that is legit, there are just six temples, and I just took out the first of six, and there's 
No surprises afterwards. It's going to be actually a pretty fast game. <laughs> well, next stream will be Friday, so maybe a little bit later. Um, you tend to get reckless and sometimes say, you know what? Oh, shit, it's 7.30. It's actually... That's actually pretty reckless. But thanks for hanging out. I appreciate it, uh, Miss Lissa. Uh, enjoy your sleeps. I'll talk to you later and see you on Friday. Bum, bum, bum. Goya blesses you. May you sleep well. <sighs> Power through. Alright, uh, so the Young Souls adventure begins. Holding an orbit hand, fate whirls around the hero, bearing burden of great responsibility. Come, start your journey, return the light of peace to the kingdom of Dotnia. Cool. Journey has begun. And, oh! I've never hit start. Apparently I can just go to save here. Well, that's good to know. The adventures of Wild Man will continue. Big font. Ooh. They have a softer font. I think I'm going to go with that. Nice. Yeah, I think... No. I think I'm going to go with that. Screen... Bright. Color... Oh, wow. I saturate the hell out of this. Ooh. Gotta keep that where it's at. Uh, so I can show the grid or not loading. Guy. So it requires reloading, so I can turn the grid off. Turn the map off if I want. Hey, why is it less screen? Hey, just because I'm in the menu. Sound, and there's nothing fun here. Album, bestiary, so what do we got here? What would I... Oh, I think I need to actually hit them with a book, if I remember. So I'm actually going to reload the save, so I want to see what it looks like without the grid. Let's see if I prefer that. I wonder if that's good enough to con be considered reloading. Oh, it can change characters at will. That's cool. Um. Okay. So, hold on. I'm trying to see what it takes to reload, as they call it. I wonder if it's literally, like, quit out the entire game? Sure, we'll do that. We'll see. We'll try this the one time. I don't think I'll, I'll you know, goof around with it too frequently. Oh, but I am curious. Da, 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 da. Go back into 3D dot game heroes. Ba, 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 ba. We're all loving it. Chugga, chugga, chugga. Chugga, 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 chugga. Reading Rainbow. Chugga, 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 chugga. Oh, why did that go goofy? Alright. This sort of thing looks like it's right in the right spot. Ba -ba -ba -bum, ba -ba -ba -bum. Alright, so we'll continue. See if that grid is still in place. Then, if it is not, we'll see if I prefer non grid versus grid. Oh, it's still gridded. I wonder what that's referring to. Hey, what's up, Pocky? Screen grid. Oh, I left the grid on. 
Save one turn for the grid to take effect. Okay. Let's we'll see what that looks like. Title. I'm just playing with a couple different settings. Uh, I've I don't know where you dropped out if it was immediately, but we did just clear out the first dungeon, so. Uh, the first of apparently six. But if that is true and there's no curveball in this, uh, this is a very fast game, but I don't remember it being that quick of a game. Like, it was about an hour-ish for us to clear out one dungeon and deal with all the intro stuff. So I can't imagine that's that. Yeah, hey, what the hell? The grid is all still here. Options, text, no, I don't want that. That, that stuck, that worked fine. Save and return to the title screen for grid options to take up. Oh, I didn't save. Okay. So let me save. Soft from soft screen. Nope, this is in fact a from software game. Um, this is 2009, which is the same year that Demon Souls comes out, and. I don't remember where it is, but I remember bumping into someone in this game that actually references, like, a character that references developing Demon Souls. So, I'm actually curious about that. Now that I have a frame of reference for what the, that is. Alright, let's see what no grid looks like. Ooh, this is not good. Oh, this does not look pretty at all. Yeah, I want my grid back. That is no bueno. Alright, so we'll turn the grid back on. We will save, and then we will get our grid back. <laughs> Rivers of blood. <laughs> Dude, so I was watching... Like, yeah, I'm playing um, 3 d Dot Game Heroes, but... Um, I was watching a video yesterday about Elden Ring, and I haven't... I haven't done that since finishing the game. Like, went through, got the Platinum, and I, like, shelved it and, like, contemplated life and the meaning of and, you know, what is my purpose. And, uh, went down a nice dark hole after finishing Elden Ring and just no other games mattered anymore. So I didn't touch it, did not read about it, didn't do anything about it. Just walked away cold turkey. Um, but then, so I just started watching some videos on YouTube the other day, um, eating dinner. And I forgot how pretty that game is. I really want to start it back up now. <laughs> uh, that game is very pretty. Um, yeah, it, it absolutely did break me for a bit. Um, but God, yeah, I definitely like it, it's it's so pretty. I, I I was seriously just in there thinking like maybe I should just boot that back up for the stream. Um, because like looking at like just them running around the world and they're highlighting bosses and techniques and stuff like that and I was like oh all this sounds real good sounds real nice um and then I know DLC is on the verge of coming out though so I don't know maybe I just wait till then yep yeah I was watching a body video um it was like top 15 something or another I don't even remember what specifically it was, but more or less it's just, you know, unknown facts about the game. Or the world, for that matter. But yeah, body videos are so freaking good for that. Of just like, oh my god, this looks beautiful. Yep, okay. So you know exactly, exactly what I was looking at, going, yeah, maybe, maybe I do need to boot this back up. Um, but yeah, just like going over, like, the story of, like, the, the merchants and like having a wandering merchant and a storyline behind that and you know Fia going through her iterations and like man all this all this sounds really good would love to get back into this so I really like just switching items with L2 R2 by the way that's really cool not having to go into the menu to tweak it Uh, I did, I only watched that one video, so I did not see, like, uh, I know he mentioned that it was a sub-video to go watch, but I did not check that one out. Yeah, there's, 
I, dude, I don't know. Like, part of me is worried that some of the content that they mention was, you know, that, like, cut content, that it's stuff that'll get patched in later, and I don't want to ruin it for myself. Because with the DLC, they could add a, a, a few chunk more. So I'm interested, and I don't want to ruin that. But at the same time, I'm just very interested. Oh, uh, I do not think this is where I want to go. Phenosin. Ooh, I don't like that text at all. I thought I would, but I don't. Alright, so we are going to change... Oh, no, not stamp shop. Uh, text. We will go back to small. Where's, like, the medium? So let's see what this looks like now. Yeah, I prefer that. Oh, that game is so good, though. I really want... Like, I was actually torn between this or doing Bloodborne. Um, but I think I'm gonna... Cute. Dog is hungry, sad. Give him poor dog food. Nice person. Uh, I think I want to... Say Bloodborne for Halloween, is what I'm thinking. But I do want to play that this year. Geologist, Desu. Des. Research many kinds of stones, Des. Playing Pixel Master, F6, not sure what the hell, blah, 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 the font. It's not that bad. Well, they actually fixed the font for uh, the console release. The original OG. I don't know if people were bitching about the console release as well, but when it originally re released on Steam, it was really fucking awful. I actually went in and modified the code that way it would show um, before there was actual mods for the text in there. You could go in and just switch it to Japanese text, but it still displayed uh, American or English characters. But it would actually fill up the box and look right, but the default font on console. No, the, even the default font on console isn't um, the OG. They switched that one. Because the original was like super thin and like this box right here, it would take up like maybe a quarter of, of the box and it was just super tiny and soulless and it was awful. I assure you it is ugly and disgusting and no one should be looking at it. Need a room? Sure. Good morning. Did you sleep well? No, I don't think so. I think people are still just pissed with the font that uh, was in there. But, you know, because I remember it was missing. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, the grace would belong to the legendary hero. But, if you're happy, it doesn't even matter. Oh, that's dope. You can just buy 99 arrows instead of having to, like, one by one by one by one. Uh, red potion restores life. Elixir restores everything. Security is pricey. Lamp. Sunstone. This being outside, just use this. Fly with the wind. Where oh, quick teleport. Ooh. It won't disappear. I like things that are, um... Aren't consumables. That's so much more charming motion than I did in the, on the box. Yeah. No, that game is... Like, all of those are gorgeous. Oh, you're talking about this. No, this game is... Yeah, this game is beautiful. I, I don't know. I like it, but... Um, I know this was before Minecraft existed, so there was no, like, boxy charm yet, but... Um... But I do just love stuff like this. Restores all magic from Magiholics. So the, the, it's it's very light-hearted, which is kind of like I, th I remember it being more cheeky, but apparently not. She play block defense, but need more time to clear it. Come back soon, okay? Sorry, but the Wind Sage is out on a journey, seeking power to seal the darkness. That's so weird that he thought this this game looked ugly. It's so pretty, though. Do, 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 do. Um, and I don't know, I don't know where you jumped in or dropped out earlier, but I went through all the different characters, and like, there's like some like I don't know, like sixty different characters you can make or run with out of the beginning. You can also make your own too. I 
can't jump down. I don't got bombs. Drop out right after trying, but yeah. So like right off the gate, when you choose your character, like I went with Wild Man because he's a weird old hermit who communes with animals. I was like, that sounds that sounds like me as I talk to my cats. But I mean, this was by no means a popular game, so I don't think you're alone in thinking that this was ugly. Got Hero Soul. Game isn't that hard. Writing is on the floor. I'm in trouble. Please recommend this message. Yes! So here's the... This absolutely went over my head then when I did it before. Uh, I'm in trouble. Recommend this message. Yes. Someone was healed. <laughs> From cave. There's something sticky on the ground. Got sticky white stuff. <laughs> Let's make a mech game in 3D environment. It'll be more fun if it has lots of parts for you that you can combine. Adventure again, so to look back, do I press down? <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah, that reference definitely went over my head the first time. Oh, you bitch. Oh, I've got a tiny little sword now. Makes me sad. Yeah, but, like, I could make a car for a character. I could be a ninja who was just, like, a, l a little spoon sticking out of the ground or something. Oh, it's straw, sorry. So I can breathe underground. Should have parried. I should have, but if you know me, I don't parry. That's not how I play games. I stab, 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 and then usually die. the Goya going on. Are you using your shield well? No. Pose ahead or quit challenging. Use R1 to guard yourself. Fuck off. Scared me and got... You, <laughs> you scared me and I got some on my feet. He was tinkling. Now what? Oh, well, you're not going outside, Goya. I'm the sign master. Yes. What's uh, uh, legendary wanderer Sir Sign left his mark on signs all over the world. His words are an inspiration to adventures everywhere. I have seen them with my own two eyes. How uh, people call me the sign master, expert in signology. Should like this illustrious rank. Let's get to it. All I need to do is view the signs left by Sir Sign, all of them. When you accomplish that, you will become the, uh, you will be granted the title sign master. Go forth. Come back soon. Yeah, so there's all these mini games I can't do yet. Grandpa said he saw a huge temple deep in the forest with no return. Said he went inside, but it's too dark. Couldn't see anything. So I'll need light. I don't think uh, I've met anyone like that. Welcome, take a look. Oh, a bow. Yes, I will buy that. Yes, I'll buy more. I'll buy some arrows. Thank you. Yeah, I know there's Goya going on, but he doesn't. <sighs> he's not happy unless he's going outside, and I'm not taking him outside right now. I see that you're talking about there's Goya's going on. He just wants attention. But we're trying to stream, buddy. Sometimes the world isn't about you. Sometimes it's about dot pixel mustaches. 
than being a hero. I was a hero, goddammit. Alright, 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 don't cut me. Alright, I guess we're gonna go with the cat cam for a uh, moment. Ah, uh, because I can't play while petting him, so. Yeah, I know, he's not happy. He's been screaming at me this entire stream. Oh, you're just gonna go up here and scratch yourself then. Alright. All that huss and fuss and muss over nothing. You don't need anything. You're freshly fed. You've got the patio open to you. The catio. You want to go outside, but that's not happening, dude. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Yeah, I need to get to the Pixel Remasters. Um, because I want to play 5, and I just haven't yet. I have them all on my Steam Deck, and what I was waiting for is apparently they're going to be patching in... It's just me now, so... Um, where is... Do, 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 game full. But apparently they're going to be patching in all the stuff that they added to um, the console versions. I'm kind of waiting on that stuff. Sure, I'll buy some candles. Yeah, so that's that's one of the, the reasons why I've held off, but I'll get to it eventually. Because I, I haven't played that since I played it on Game Boy Advance. And that was 2005. Even a local like me can lose his way. Yes. Yes, I ruin night. God, time is fucking impossible, by the way. Like, I remember... And I, I really don't want this stream to start becoming that, but... Just got control of the blackjack. Nice. Um, which, fun fact about that, so you have, um, oh my god, is it Edgar? No, what the fuck is his name? The, um, the gambler. Setzer. Yes, thank you, Setzer. So, fun fact with him that I found out is that he starts the, uh, the game with a bandana, like when you first get him in your group, and if you unequip it, you cannot equip it back on. And that's purely because he saw that Locke has one, and now that someone else has done it, it's no longer cool. So he decided he will not wear it again. So a fun little game mechanic that they originally thought was a bug, so then they took it out of the Game Boy Advance version. I don't know if it's in the Pixel Remaster. It should be, but it's definitely in the original release of it. Because he's just that vain. Oh, so here's the save point. So, what I want to do is, um, since I'm here, because that'll just restart me right here at the end. I was going to show you all the freaking cool characters so you can be, other than the, the wild man that I chose. So if I go to continue, it lets me choose my character, I believe. Change character? Yes. Okay. So they have from. I didn't realize that they have actually different stats too. Interesting. So you've got your knights, you've got your princes, samurai, dwarf, Scholars, Assassins, Dragons, Santa, and Santa Funk. Okay, things are getting a little bit weird. I didn't realize there's a copyright button down there, too. But then as we keep going, you get stuff like GT Car, Shirk, Hero, President, X-7th pres President of the United States, who has gone missing. Who was like a dragon mech. Caveman, Manager, a Businessman, who will save the world so he can plan his retirement. Shisho, Ranger, Tank, Racer, Banco, Red Dog. Like, they've got all these wild freaking things. Okita, Raiko, Glint, who looks like a giant mech. And since this is from Soft, it's probably from um, an Armored Core reference that I don't know. Rikamaru, Poochi. Banco is like a punk kid. Is it? Alright. Go ahead, we got that. So 
sporting awesome hair, this Banco calls the Dark King a Shibatsu. So maybe you know what Shibatsu is, because I do not. Ayami uh, Konaichi, the Zuma clan, her blade is as sharp as cold as her smithy soldier. But don't don't worry, they have mean hair. Killer rabbit's sharp teeth are anything but ordinary. Knight, succubus, witch, galleon. So it's a ship. We got an angel. Boxer, heroine, gorilla, came from the high row in hopes of finding food. A ninja, like I said, he breathes through a snorkel. A reckless princess, the king, vampire, pumpkin man, wolf man, wild man, who is what I was playing as, the antisocial, sorry, an antisocial man who communes with animals in the mountains. Uh, I can be a maid, live in maid who just earned her vacation, but then dot dot dot. Uh, Geisha, Frank, as short for Frankenstein. Dark Dwarf, Blue Dragon, Red Dragon, Dragoon. Striker, Shippu, a ninja who follows his own path. His will is unbreakable. Arcade Hero, Aski, Blue Screen of Death. Go save Dotnia or Crash Trying. Birdie, Big Cluckin. Beholder, Bok Bok, Brawl, Brimley, a true gentleman, Bunblade, Calories, which I don't know what the fuck this is, uh, when things go wrong in Dotnia, you know who to blame, Chatty, a pair of teeth, Cobra, Cosplayer, Evil Manta, Duckman, Dead Skull, Cowgirl, Floaty, Kit, Happy, Light Size Hero with a smile and a sword, Hummer, not what you're thinking, Jitsu, Joystick, La Lamia, Careful, she'll eat your children. Lily old lady, Quite the heroine back in her youth. Mimic, Me Mummy, Manon, which is half man, half tank, all Manon. He's a man with a cannon coming out of his chest. Uh, Lost Hat, Mr. Ebox, Nimby, Hanga Mech, uh, Penguin inside of a mech suit. Phoenix, Rad Nanner, which is a banana on a skateboard, Ratman, Red Eye, Robo Team, Taco Man, which is the amazing half eaten Taco Man, Spinny, Spike, Dog that once lived here is sad. It's just the house. Sheep Suit, Templar, Thrust, so the Mick Viper is one of many prototypes, Tiny Woman, Tungi, which is terrifying. All I ever wanted was a kiss. And it's just a tongue coming out of a mouth. Uh, Tortuga, Sloan studied, put uh, to the ultimate test. Vampira, vampire girl who has always wanted to be a gothic Lolita. Venus, a carnivorous plant bound to an ordinary pot. Wheels, handicap never stops a hero. And then last we have Sackboy, which she's the only one that has um, copyright. So they, they added that function just to get Sackboy in here. So, as you can tell, very peculiar list of characters uh, to choose from by default, but you also, if you want, uh, can make your own. So, sky's the limit. Hi, Coco. Ridiculous game. Alright, so I'm back in business now. I don't know what it means when you can see like that pig goblin thing has a crown on. I don't know if that just means they're stronger or they're guaranteed to drop something. Haven't made a penis man yet. Uh, I haven't. Doesn't mean that someone hasn't. Uh, I just started this up tonight, so... Uh, my adventures are early and I was not... Um, wanting to spend a lot of time on the creation aspect. I might turn the map back on. Options... And the map on and the cameras are fun like if you really wanted to like I really like the low angle kind of reminds me of like how skate like having that angle if you want you can just go like full on overhead and really get the original Zelda feel but it's not necessarily what I want to do and then D I think is actually closer than A yeah I think A is the, the sweet spot I think they're right to default to that 
course, there's no return. Danger ahead. Yeah, I want to check over here, though. Penis, man. Um, and if I remember correctly, you can actually draw a sword at some point, so... I'm sure there are some terrifying things online already. This is this Tabula Raza that Sage Indy was talking about? He told us how to reveal its secrets, right? Yep. Magic might help. Excuse me, Coco. I'm gonna take a picture of this coconut so I can cheat. Because back in the day, people used to draw shit like weirdos. Not me, I just take a picture of it. That was a very Dragon Quest sound effect. Oh, what, the summoning, or the magic spell? I do not know Dragon Quest at all, so I cannot speak on that front. Alright, so I'm cheating and using my map to determine which way to go through the Lost Woods. Alright, so that was up one, then I'm gonna go right one. Whoa, you bitch! Fuck off! Goddamn white sicky stuff got me. What the fuck is that thing? This thing is annoying. Thank you. Alright, so that threw me off. Alright, I need to go up. That dude was all about my nuts, and I don't know what the fuck that was about. He fucked me up good, though. Really needs you to drop some apple for me. That's an arrow, not an apple. Fuck, I lost track of what I was doing. I think I went up, so now I need to go right or left. Sorry. Oh, you bitch! I don't even see you. Um, did you pick up Tears of the Kingdom? I don't know if you are playing that or if you were not in a rush to grab it. Because I thought I remember you being big on Breath of the Wild. You're not a curmudgeon like me and you actually enjoy things still. I, technically, I did purchase it, but um, I lent it out to someone already, so... Because I, I plan on playing it on stream, but I'm not in the mood to play it right now. I'd much rather people get um, a bit of it under their belts. That way, I can just let them direct me on what to do. That way, uh, it's not completely embarrassing again, but it probably still will be. Still need to beat Breath of the Wild. Jesus, dude. What the fuck are you waiting for? A human and a fairy here. What brings you two to such a place? We're on our way to the temple. It's filled with monsters. Don't go. We understand the dangers. Must save the kingdom. Uh, has to find the six orbs. And you're the world famous scholar. Read your dissertation on endgame grinding. It was quite epic. Apologize. Uh, I'll. I apologize. I'm Indigo. The force stage. Usually reside in the temple, but uh, fiends have taken over. When I was younger, I could have shown them, but all I could do was seal the orbs room and flee. So sorry, Sage Indigo, but please, you can rest easy now. Master Wildman, we'll deal with the monsters and bring back the orb. Ah, thank you. You have my support. I will await your return. Defeat the boss and bring and break the orb room seal. If you bring it back, I will grant you its magic. Understood, Master Wildman. Let's do this. We'll be back. When I stick toxin out of that game. Yeah. That, well... That's the thing. So, it, to me, it seems like that game was literally made for TikTok. Like, I... I don't know if there's more to the game or not. But it almost seems like they built it... 
just for the nonsense um, shares. Alright, how do I get to my menu? And I want to use my sleeping bag. I forget, did you watch me finish Breath of the Wild or were you not there for that stream? Alright, before I go in here, I'm going to run the ads. You're, you're sub, so it won't matter, but... I hit run ad, that way I get another... Another hour of no pre-roll ads, so if anyone jumps in, uh, you were not there. It was a good conclusion, so... Like, I went into the castle and beat Ganon all on one stream, so when you go through, if you're semi-prepared, which you probably are, because... I only did like 52 shrines, but um, if you go in there and you're good to go, yeah, that's it's less than three hours from start to finish. But I mean, if you're in no rush to play Tears of the Kingdom, then fucking have at it. Like, whenever you get there, you get there. Forest Temple. Even I can figure this one out. I'll handle this. If I push this, the door should open. Here it goes. What? The switch went back to its position. Guess I spoke too soon. By the way, the statue looks expensive. Can we take it home? Not sure why I didn't do the final stretch. I don't know why you didn't do the final stretch either. This game is such a direct ripoff of Zelda, it's hilarious to me. I have all the memories. Yeah, what are you waiting on? Like, why did you stop? No answer, it seems uh, he was a mirror game developer. It's writing on the wall. Will you read it? Sure. Take it from me. Ramming into foes, even from the side, doesn't work here. Okay. Now, so... Top left and right middle. I, I apologize, I... That cat is catting like a cat has never catted before, and there's literally nothing he wants other than going outside at this point. And I'm not letting him go out solo, so... But he wants to. It's too dark to see anything. Do you have a light? Sure I do, but it doesn't show up there. Um, how do I use it? I'll use this, yes. God damn it. Why was that thing next to me? Does it say meats? Memes? Is that a bag of memes? So confused. Oh, memes. Okay. Yeah. Why is there a bag of memes in my channel? That is so bizarre. Alright, so I do not have bombs. There we go. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Oh, these things rushing me as soon as I walk in there is kind of a uh, bullshit, as the French say. Oh my 
god. Got a key. Man, it still bums me out that PS3 is not backwards compatible with any... Er, nothing is backwards compatible with PS3, I should say. Because... Like, the fact that I need a PS3 to play this kind of sucks. Because it's not on PC, it's not on PS4. There's n Like, this will never get remade. They got Dark Souls and Elden Ring money going on. So this is just tied to the past, unless you own a PS3. Maybe it's on one of those PS Now services or something, I don't know. But there's no way in hell I'm ever going to sub to any of those. No, oh, fuck off. What do you want, fairy? Maybe there's a secret to that floor tile. Maybe there is. Maybe I need to kill all these skeletons first. And then we can work about the war of the puzzle. Oof, the lighting is making this level lag, actually. Honesty is equilibrium. Okay, so that doesn't work. I'll oh, check that out. Answers. Wait, does X mean push? I think so, because this is Japanese, so we'll just say I should probably put it on these two. But in my brain, it thinks it should go on the circles. God, fuck. There we go. Nope, it wants circles. Okay, then. See, I already got anxiety looking at all the games I own and haven't played. Don't need anxiety. Uh, a giant library of games to distract me. Are you talking about, like, PS Now, or you mean if this was backwards compatible? Yeah, I, I don't like Game Pass because, like you said, it's just... It's just a lot of fucking distraction. And, like, in, in my brain, if I'm not willing to buy it, why on earth should I do that, then? Like, time is very limited, right? So, if I'm not willing to spend money on it, why would I want to have it and just dink around? I don't know. But I guess, like, finishing games is a thing of the past, too, so... Now it's less important that it's a game you own that you revisit. It's just, hey, can I can I kill four hours playing this and not get bored? Okay, good. Or hey, maybe it's a five hour game and I get an hour of entertainment out of it. That's good enough. Yeah, my brain just does like yeah, it does not work for me. I'm trying to be okay with not finishing a game. Yeah, I mean, in theory. Fudge. God bless. Are you fucking serious? That's bullshit. Um... Yeah, it's just, it's hard to walk away from a game for me. Not because I need to squeeze every drop of it, but like, normally I play story-based games, and if you only do part of the story, oh, that's my fault. If you only do part of the story, it, it doesn't feel complete. Um, Red Key, I'm assuming, is the... Not the boss key. What is that? Hmm. I don't know. I'm going to keep on going over to the yellow key, though. Um, I'm going to clear this room. Just 
just went just on its own Doom Eternal because I was feeling obligated to play it since it started, but it was not having fun with it. No, absolutely quit those games. Yeah, that that is the right call on that one. I, it's been a while since I've had that, but I would absolutely do the same if that was the case. You bitch. Oh, oops. Oh my god, push. Push, push, blocky lightning. I can only push it once? I've not played a game with a slide block puzzle in such a long time. You fuckers are not taking my giant. Oh! You bitch! I hate lasers so much. Don't you start with me too, Goya. But yeah, it's been a while since I've started a game and forced myself to keep playing when I don't like it. I actually do not recall the last time I've done that. I mean, hell, the last game I was streaming called, um... What was this piece of shit? Oh, I put it away. Last Cure or something like that? Um, ooh, excuse me, uh, that's a game that I did not finish. I got stuck on the back half of it and I just ended up deciding, yeah, I'm good with it. Um, like part of me is like, ah, I should go back and finish it, but it's like, I'll just like read Wikipedia if I really need to know what the fuck happened with it. Cause like part of me, especially with streaming, Felt obligated since I started on stream that I should finish it on stream, but I was like, nah, I'm I'm good on that. And I was torn between this and like I said, I really wanted to play this, and then um, Michi was suggesting that I fire back up that uh, the Stranger of Paradise and keep playing through that, and my mind just isn't in that mode for that game. Like the game was fine, I just, I don't know. There's something about it that I wasn't vibing with immediately. No answer, it's merely a stone sign. You need a key. Okay. Well, I got bombs for the first time, so... Straight up is the boss. Which I do not have. But I can activate that, so now I can teleport here. Cool. So it's currently 8.20. Um, and I think I'm going to go until 9.30 tonight. Do three hours of streaming, and then I'll call it about that point. Uh, depending on what makes sense. If I hit, like, a natural end point of the stream tonight. Um, like, a end of a dungeon or something like that. Hey! This wall has a crack. Maybe we can destroy it. Maybe we can. Um, but really, this tonight I just wanted to get the kinks out, um, get streaming again, make sure everything works because I haven't done it in a while and this stuff gets very janky very quickly. And apparently Goya needs to adjust to the fact that I do this because Boy is not having it. Got a key. Alright, so I'm gonna go back because I know there are some more bomb walls for me to get to. Oh, I can't see shit. 
almost running out of candles too. Oh shit, this is... yep. Alright, good. Yeah, so tonight is less worried about... Sorry, back. This chair is not loving me today. Um, but less about getting far into the game, more about making sure all my stream setup still works. And even getting myself back to into the commitment of running this. Because it has been some time. Uh, I don't even want to look at it. Assuming it's somewhere like six weeks. Feels like it at least. Alright, and this just takes me back to where I already was. Shit. Should give me an apple. You got rain, son. Alright, so. Oh, I just didn't go up. I thought. Oh, fucking arrows. I thought it was a bomb wall that I skipped or something. And sometimes these things really just mash into you pretty hard. I wonder if I can... Yeah, just shield these things. I guess that's the proper way to do these rooms. When have I ever done anything proper? Check the map in a second. You bitch! Alright, so let's see what's on this side. Alright, cool, this is a bomb. Alright, got all that. So now let's drop a bomb here. these small blocks are for, but I've got a few of them now. They have not explained what they are. Alright, good. And I forgot until I started playing this how... Oh, fuck off. Where the fuck am I supposed to get a key from? been everywhere. Are there two types of keys? Oh, there must be. Alright, this one doesn't work on this door, so I guess I gotta go way, 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 way back. Left, 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 and then, oh, okay. Left until I can't left no more. Yeah, and as you upgrade your sword, you can get more and more powerful, um, uh, length, width, uh, special attack, power. Like, there's all these different ways to augment your swords as you level it up. Just by throwing money into it, but it's it can only level up to a certain point. Um, so it's one of those, like, choose wisely situations. Alright, thank god. Alright, so where I need to go up, left... And I 
I should be able to key that bottom door now. Doink, monies. Alright. Alright, cool. Okay, cool. Alright, what do I do in here? There's a button back here. Oh, you surly bitch. Everybody hydrates. Preferably water, but whatever the hell makes you happy. Cheers, I'm switching over to flat water as they call it. Indoor tap water. <sighs> Hydration good. Well, I don't know which ones I can push, goddammit. They don't tell me. Alright, cool. Boss key. So I'm confused because there's that red key and my key didn't work on it. So I wonder what, what that's about. But whatever. I've got enough to go kill this boss now. i got full health. I don't got full magic, but hopefully that's not an issue. And I'm going to save before I fight the boss because that's what we do. that we are. Yeah, this chair is... I think I need a chair at this point. This thing just does not support the way it should. Alright. Boss time. So first time is the giant snake. We'll see what this boss is. Ah, oh, bullshit. Yeah, this is going to be fine until I take damage. And it's going to suck. So just don't take damage, right? Ah, oh, you bitch. You... you. Oh, stupid bee. Stop pissing on me. Oh god, this guy just fucked me hard. Oh, he respawns bees. Goody, goody. I'm down to half a life. I'm dead. God damn it. Bees! Wow. Well, that, that felt like a Dark Souls experience. It was about time. I was wondering how long until that happened. I have no magic that's useful in here. I should probably try not getting hit this time. That's on my agenda. <laughs> he bosses the melee of this game. Uh, if it revives after this, yeah, I'm gonna be pissed. You're not helping, Goya. Oh, Goya, you are definitely not helping. Why would you jump up here right now, dude? Well, don't get mad at me. I can't trust you to go outside. You're a danger kitty. You'd go out in the street or something. Oh, he made another crown of bees. So, minor pet peeve of this and, and games in general. Which is really weird that this is from soft, but I don't like when things don't have health bars. Yep. 
There we go. Pop that bitch like a pinata. And we get all my monies. Don't disappear. I want my money. Oof. I have a health bar. I want the boss to have a health bar. I want Millennia the Bee to have a health bar. He needs to know how, how far I, I gotta go with him. Even like the old like Simpsons and Ninja Turtles, uh, you know, when the boss is taking damage and getting close to dying, they just flash more rapidly, like something. Some sort of indicator. That says, hey, Goya, what are you up to trying to get in front of me when I'm trying to fight the Bee Queen? Hmm? What's up with that, buddy? Why, why do you seek to disrupt everything? Why does it always have to be about you, buddy? Mm hmm? Squishy ear. Fluffy butt. Well. There you go. Life up get, indeed. Got the green orb. What does the green orb do? Ah, uh, you did it, Master Wild Man. You fought that huge bee off without the slightest hesitation. Master, I believe you are the hero who can save our kingdom. Well, I'm glad you feel that way now after I have two orbs. Favor ask of you. My friends were captured by the man who calls himself the Dark Bishop. Don't know where they are, but they're out there. Please help them. Uh, let's bring the orb back to Sage Indigo and the Force of No Return. Yeah, after I get this. Wondering. Yeah, and I can resurrect the bosses if I want, which is weird, but it's an option. I'm assuming that they just drop lots of money, so maybe people farm them for that. Because money is effectively experience and you just upgrade your swords and stuff. Yeah, so it's about an hour per dungeon so far. This two hour mark, we just finished the second dungeon. First hour mark, we finished the first dungeon, so. Very brisk game. I'm kind of digging it. Ah, that's most certainly the green orb. Well done, brave one. Now accept this power. Reflect. Shader magic reflect. This magic will reflect enemy spells. Master Wild, man. It does just what a name says. Just what the name says it does. Amazing. I feel like we're one step closer to peace. Sage Indigo, what should our next destination be? Far to the east lies a desert temple. Perhaps you should pay a visit there. Thank you, let's head east to the castle then, Master Wildman. Yes, we should do that. So, I do have the fancy new item. Or at least one of them, that wind wing. Move to any town on the map. I like fast travel. More games should let me fast travel. Hmm. Alright, good times. Save. The boss is dead. I feel secure at the save. Alright, so far to the east we have a desert. And now I have bombs, so I can bomb shit. Actually, mm, no, I don't want to mess with the blacksmith yet. Found the sign. I saw the sign. Oh, I'm sick of the map. So, desert, lower right. It looks like there is a bridge to the right. Or there's another one down. So, let's we'll see which one they have me take. Imagine just the one directly to the right. Ah, yes, a bridge. Oh, yeah. Fucking bunny. Better give me my apple. I feel like I should go in this cave. What on earth is this? 
Nice info for 50G. Sure. Thanks for the business. See any rare monsters? Do your best to run. What? Ugh. That was a waste of money. Water's pretty, though. Very shiny. Definitely cannot reach those things, though. Dun, 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 dun. Fucking bees. I already killed your queen. Ooh, nice. I can get candles. Um, and a sleeping bag. Nice. And, of course, I can't go through there. Yeah, I'm 1,000% okay if this is just six dungeons. Like, granted, that'll be, like, six hours then. Maybe a small curveball, but if this is ten or less, I'm 1,000% I'm okay with that. I don't need games to be all a billion hours long like they are these days. Modern releases. Like, got the point. Like, uh, this reminds me a bit of Evil Land. Uh, which was another, like, throwback game, but that was a little bit more interesting with how stuff evolved through time. When do you unlock D? Let me guess. D's nuts? Hmm? Is that what you're getting at? <coughs> Excuse me. Yeah, I had a feeling you were going there. Partially because I know you. So I don't think this is the direction I want to go, because it is leaving the, getting away from the desert. Oh, I can't tell by looking at the map. Oh, I'll try going back. Hey, it's Mega Man. They definitely had a, a load, so let's see if I can look at the loading art. Let's see if they need them. But they look to all be based off of other games. Or different scenarios. Like this looks kind of Dragon Ball-y to me, but I don't know. Kind of mad I slept on this game. Dude, most people slept on this game, so it's not just you. I don't know what this one is. Definitely it's something. So yeah, this one was the one that I just saw and made me think Mega Man. Where's the Gears of War one that I saw? No, oh, Castlevania. Don't know what that one is. I'm gonna have to look online and see if there's something. So, like, this one makes me think, like, Gears of War. Oh, that was Dragon Quest 1. Gotcha. Like, this one looks like it should probably be more Dragon Quest 2. I feel like I should know what this one is. This one looks like um, the stupid Nintendo guy where he reaches out his hands. The the little ball juggling game. This is the first one that I saw that I thought Gears of War. I thought Dom and Marcus. Yeah, so I'm gonna check that out later and see. Because they don't give them names or anything, so I'm curious. Thief, maybe? Anyways, eh, just a cool little aside. But yeah, the other thing I remember with this is the bestiary. Is it's booked monsters. Because you actually go around with a giant book as your weapon. And if you kill them with it, then it saves them into your monster. Oh wow, there's actually not that many. 
So it's what, five, so it's 15, 30, five, 36, there's only 37 enemies. And then eight bosses. Okay, yeah, so this is a pretty cool game. Uh, do the characters all play the same? I don't think so. Like, like I, I didn't, I thought that they were, but I think there's like Scholar, Rogue, and Knight, at least, that play differently. Um, but on the first loading screen, like, some of them said, like, you know, the attacks hard, moves fast, blah, 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 nonsense. So I think there should be some difference. Probably one is stronger than, like, Scholar probably has more magic. Because I have a ton of magic and not that much health, so I'd assume so. And I'm playing as a Scholar. It's probably just like starting stat or buff stat, whatever you want to call it. God, that dude had some juice to him. Oh, let me check the map. Yes, I need to keep going lower, right? level is going to be annoying, isn't it? In this desert. Have you spent any souls yet? <laughs> uh, no. I have not spent any money to upgrade anything yet. The only thing is that I bought my shield. Like, I started with a wooden shield, so I upgraded. One G. Awesome. Partially because, like, right now, it's like I can upload or upgrade the length, the width, or some other stuff. Take the Vatara detour to find new Nutra Desert. Nutra Agency. Um, and I didn't know necessarily which I wanted yet. So I thought I would just hang on to uh, all my money till there was a clear, like, I wish this was wide. Um, there's something that'll let me fire beams from my sword. I don't know if I need to unlock that or if I just buy it. Um, and also, I don't know what the other weapons are and if the sword is the one that I want to upgrade. So, have not upgraded yet. Oh, boy, yeah. I wonder out of the 37 enemies if, like, powered up versions counts as something separate, or if they are just the same thing. Like the dudes with the crowns on their head. Now, with these types of games, are like, you mentioned that your catnip is the, um, the fucking exploration, whatever, the Castlevania games. Metroidvanias. Um, my catnip ends up being games like this, which is the same as Adventures of Mana, which is the same as Link to the Past. Go east of the highlands to find the Nutri Desert to the south. So keep heading east. So games like this are usually something I can get in and tear apart uh, and not get bored the entire time. It's fantastic. Wish sure I could just blow it up. Can can I just blow it up? Oh, I can. Excellent. Current one is pissing. Which uh, which one is that again? The night witch. Why is it just getting hard on you, or what? Or is it just a bunch of bullshit? <laughs> you bitch. That's why I didn't eat my apple yet. Ah, uh, probably get fired. Pretty sure Martel combat is mini shoot 'em up levels. 
So what's the part that's pissing you off? That sounds kind of rad. Oh man, it's so. Uh, somewhat changing subjects. Um, speaking of shoot 'em ups, uh, what's it? South is neutral desert. Okay, is um, near Automata. Fantastic game with its mixed styles, shoot 'em ups, and blah blah blahs and all that. So I'm watching the anime right now, and I didn't know this, but the anime stops at episode eight on a 24 episode run because of for the second time they're having COVID delays. So, and they don't know when it's going to return. So, episode 9 just has not existed, and it's been a couple weeks. Uh, the English episodes, or dub, has caught up at this point. Uh, there's just no episode 9. And it sucks, because they were starting, I want to say, like, on episode 5. Started heavily diverging from near Automata, and now it's just like, oh, by the way, you don't get any more. So, fuck you. So that sucks. That's where I'm currently at in life. Just being upset that I can't watch more cartoons of a show of a game that I already know how it ends. See, under level in the current encounter, and that keeps fucking up. It's rad. Apparently a... Oh, I'm in a town. Okay. Ish. Ish. In town-ish. I'm actually curious real fast. Friends on PSN. Am I even... Oh, I am connected. Okay. Actually, so I have 32% of... Yeah, so I played this in 2011. Jesus Christ. Uh, or at least, yeah. Those are when I have some trophies. Do you defeat a foe with a sword? A foe with a bow? With a bomb? Played the game for five hours. Guarded an attack. Defeated a guardian. Defeated Eligon without taking damage. The B without... Oh, so that's why you can go back and re-challenge him. Super Golem. Kraken. Got some hidden trophies. I found Sue. Use shader magic. Max out the life bar, which I did not do. Max out the magic, did not do. Clear the game without restoring the princess. Wow, that sounds like a dick move. Booked a monster, and all the shit is hidden. Complete the bestiary. The ancient sword, holy sword, hero sword. Acquired a sword from the king from King Block. Acquire all swords, which I did not do. Forge the sword, hidden. Collect 777G. Did not make a character model. Did not visit all maps. Took a snapshot, don't know, don't know. Acquired the hero shield and don't know. Wow, there's a lot of shit I skipped out on. Uh, beyond your basic shot, you can set up a deck of spells. Spells cost mana that enemies sometimes drop, and only three of your deck are available at a time. Use a spell, and the next spell... In your deck comes up, um, and the one you just use goes to the bottom. Oh, I gotcha. That's not something I like. That was, um, Kingdom Hearts Chain of Memories did that shit. Kurt Level, you have five mana. Yeah, uh, Godspeed to you on that one. Alright, back into the game. I was just curious how many, like, where my trophy uh, status was. This town is lacking. Heard about a great dancer in Rayjack. Could you find her for me? Sure. Spell costs four or five. Jesus Christ. Sounds like you need more mana. You're the hero, aren't you? So you can carry money? Can you spare me 100? G? Sure. Have my money. Come back later, I'll have your money. I have a feeling I'm going to fucking regret that, but... Yeah, you should probably level them. Just a hunch. 
quicksand on the way to Katera to avoid it, try walking between the cacti. That sounds like useful info. So bummed. I want a ring for my birthday, but all I got was this dumb bestiary. Ooh, I need a ring. But I can get the bestiary. Yeah, when I played this back in the day, I absolutely gave no shits about trophies. Isn't leveling from Ghani, you gain, gain XP by resting people from dungeons. Ooh, got a life shard. Piece of heart. Yeah, see, I don't do the whole rescuing thing, I do the whole killing thing. Alright, so I need to bring a dancer here, and I need to find a ring. So what you, what you, what you want? Got him, 100 per bottle, sure. It's two bottles now. Alright, thanks. All sold out, that's what I thought. Ooh, cutscene? Bruyo, m-m-lady, you can't travel alone. Or you act like the princess you are. Enough, I will be entering the martial arts tournament. First off. Don't be so reckless, you must reconsider, Elena. Nothing you two will say will change my mind. What if I cut her leg off? That'd probably stop her. How do I explain this to your father, the king? Okay, so that's a princess. Such a cute kitty cat, I want to take it home. Meow. Alright, what's in here? Nothing. Got a water jar. Please bring water from Colneria Village. I don't think I've been there yet. Nope, just Ray Jack. Ortego. I'm guessing it's height and plenty of this freaking monitor like you can see. I'm guessing it's down in the water, like below the Dotnia Castle. It looks like there is a village there. That's my guess. God, this map even looks like Legend of Zelda, or at least Link to the Past. Like the lower left in Link to the Past is a sand dungeon, which this looks like it might have that. You've got the Lost Woods on the top left. But in the backscape, you have Death Mountain across all of it, including the frickin' tower is where it is, at least on Link's Awakening. That's where, like, the Coalent Tower is, where, you know, you wake the windfish. The right side of the map has the desert. And then the... Yeah, this is legit just like, hey, how do we make Zelda? <laughs> uh, so we need to go back to Old Ones and explore for secrets to rescue people. It's all good. You have kids. That's what they do. I've got a Goya. He's been doing that to me all freaking day. Uh, and I probably shouldn't have said his name because it's going to encourage him some more. Like, I don't... When I play this, I don't remember there being side quests. So I definitely don't think I, I fucked around with any of that. Want to play Blockout? Sure. Good luck. Blockout. View the tutorial? Sure, because I have no idea what this is. Uh, you must reflect the balls to destroy all the blocks. Once you've destroyed them all, you'll proceed to the next stage. Use guard to shoot the ball at the beginning. You can reflect the ball with your sword or shield. The ball hits the player at the bottom of the wall. You lose. Left to right, and right to your position, you can't move forward. You have three lives. Do your best to destroy the block, press select, quit at any time. Miss.
Holy pussies do tutorials. Jesus. What have I ever done to you? Oh my god, what is this? Was not expecting this. God, what's the green one gonna do? Why is there a red ball now? Oh, just steam rolls, it doesn't bounce. Oh shit, stage two. What a weird thing to just drop in this game. Wow, that was bullshit. I should not have gotten that. Yes, I know it's breakout, but I just I'm surprised that they put it inside of Legend of Zelda. No. I will not play again. Thank you for Thank you for playing. Buy anything you need. Life, sleeping bag, candles, lamp, wind wing, sunstones. For dungeon haters. <laughs> Shoe bowling. Don't know what that is. I I mean Zelda. I get that, but I don't know what bomb shoe bowling's from. Don't have an M, but there's one to the south. Cool. It's the blacksmith where I can play with my sword. Buy whatever you need. So you got arrows and bombs, bombs and arrows, arrows and bombs. Oh, so you don't actually let me blacksmith? Oh, that's a bunch of bullshit. Oh, Majora's Mask. Fuck that game. Sorry, I kid. It's a fantastic game. Just hard. Well, I had the light gem. I don't remember bomb shoot bowling. Ah, that was FF1. That's another FF. Don't know what that one is. That looks bad. That was Chrono Trigger. Ha! Hopefully you saw that. That's kind of fun. Yeah, I definitely need to find out what the fuck the rest of these are. Some of them obvious are a little bit more obvious than others, but... Like, I have no clue what this one is here. Oh, this is fucking Earthbound. I was looking at this one earlier and I didn't know what it was. But yeah, that's gotta be Earthbound. Oh, I could see that being Chrono Cross. Yeah, yeah, because that's that, uh, the big cat dude in the background. Good call. Ah, oh, Lemmings. I don't even remember seeing that one. So they're not even limited to like to um action game or um RPGs. That's what my brain first was. Yeah, that that's actually a really good chrono trigger there. Good job on them. Where did my final Yeah, the Final Fantasy one looks cool. Or no, that's Final Fantasy two. So it's Furion. So I'm wondering if Final Fantasy 3 goes here, because then this is Final Fantasy 4. So I don't remember this being... I wonder if this is Final Fantasy 5, but I don't remember this. So I don't know what that is. I'm just assuming that they did, because this is 2, 3, then 4, so that would be 5 if they kept it. This would be Final Fantasy 1 if I had it. But anyways... Fun times, good times. I'm sorry, was there something in here? Uh, would you like the poof poof? I need a weave to translate. What is the poof poof? Uh. <laughs> 
come over here. I'll just dim the lights. Lights off now. And I get the poof poof. Yes, have a seat right there. Poof, poof, poof. Hee hee. Poof, poof, poof. Tee hee hee hee. What a nice feeling. What could it be? Wow. <laughs> How'd you like the poofing, youngster? This is my dad. His back rubs are masterful. Back to work. If you need the poof poof, don't be shy. I see. Well, Dragon Quest just got me poof poof. But yeah, this is a very charming little game. Uh, it sucks that you slept on it. I remember enjoying it, but I'm definitely enjoying it more now. Um, than I did at the time. I think I just played through it straightforward as its own game. Unless, uh, an homage to other games. I think I've kind of grown my, um, my RPG. Ah, fuck. My, um, oh, that's a kickback. But I've grown uh, my RPG vocabulary, if you will. Can I rock that? Or bomb that? It looks like I can bomb it. I wonder why I would, though. No, I cannot. So, hang on. I'm going to run... Some ads, which you're subbed, so you're fine, but uh, for anyone else that might be dropping that is not subbed, ad time. And that'll be the last ad that I run for the evening because it is 9.02. I will go till 9.30 about, uh, and then I will call it, so should be a good run. That definitely looks bombable, though. Soccer. Oh, fuck off. I don't have the hook shot yet. Oh, I am excited. I did hear for, um, the, uh, whatchamacallit, the Final Fantasy Pixel Remastered that in Final Fantasy 4, they did away with ammo being, or, um, specifically, um, arrows being consumables. So you can just equip Rosa with some bomb-ass arrows and go to town on shit. I thought that was, uh, a fantastic move. So she might actually be useful now. Like, I'm sorry, like, consumables in games are probably one of the most annoying things for me. Like, I see no value in it. It doesn't add to the immersion. It's not more interesting. I hate inventory management at that scale. Like that, that is the one thing I will say that I enjoyed with Breath of the Wild is that bombs were a skill and it was not Um, it was not consumables, so I felt a lot more open to play with them and do my thing. Oh, you fuckers. I assume I go down here? You know, like as much. Oh God, fuck you! I, I meant to look at my map. As much as I wanted to keep exploring, yeah, I do wanna. Oh, I really do feel like I should go to that inn first, though. But I don't know if that shifting sand thing would have taken me there, anyways. Anyways.
Uh, going back to the poo poo, it's a reference to having squeezed tits or having your face squished by tits. Uh, well, that I don't think occurred. Or maybe it did by that old man? I don't know. I feel like that is, um. not kosher. I forget who it was. Someone I know was just starting to watch Dragon Ball. Like the original Dragon Ball. And they were like, bro, did you know that this this show was just fucking horny? I was like, yes. And they're like, it's so fucking weird. Like, I was like, yeah. With fucking young uh, Goku just constantly squeezing people's crotches asking, are you a boy or a girl? It's like, yeah. Dragon Ball was messed up. Uh, good evening, Mori. Howdy and hello. Uh, let's see, in the DQ games, you should run into a hot chick offering that. When you close your eyes, they get slimes in your face, gotcha. Dragon all is like suscapades, yes. Exactly. The yeah, original Dragon Ball is not all fighting nonsense, it's just full on horny being a kid. <laughs> Got a life shard. Good. Alright, let's see. Get through here. But Mori, good evening. Uh, FYI, we are quitting at 9.30, so it gives me about 23 more minutes. Give or take, depending on where I'm at with the game. They dropped their horniness pretty early on. <laughs> um, I just realized because if I'm in the dungeon, if I try to save and quit, I'm going to have to run back there again. That was another Final Fantasy cover there. I don't know which one. Oh, that was Final Fantasy V because that was uh, Boko and uh, Butts hanging out. Hi, Coco. We're going to cat cam for Coco for a moment. Yeah, because this game is going to make me reappear at the last end that I went to. Um, so depending on where I'm at in the dungeon, I might just try and finish the dungeon before I quit. Because back on PS3, we don't have a suspend mode, do we, Coco? Fluffy Coco. Boom, boom, boom. But yeah, I thought I remembered something with that with the, the poof poof. I forgot there were slimes, because that's what that show does, or, um, game series does. And then, frickin', what is it, Lost, not Lost Odyssey, Blue Dragon did their best to imitate Dragon. Oh, I didn't realize we have, a. Uh, there's a Void back here, too. You can see against, yeah, I didn't even realize he was up here. He's been behaving, finally. But, um... But the uh, Dragon Quest uh, knockoff Blue Dragon has like the, the golden poop monsters. And yeah, that sense of humor Dragon Quest is lost on me. He will all be consumed by the void. Well, I sure as hell will, that's for sure. This guy is looking to end me tonight. I can't say his name because then he'll get excited to come over here and then this coconut thing uh, will come to an end as well. Aw, oh, sweet Coco. You're on camera, girl. The whole world can see you, despite the fact that you always try and hide as much as possible. Not right now. We all see you. It's funny watching the camera adjust the, light, uh, the white balance to her fur. Because she's just shimmering. Can I play my game more or no? I'm almost done, Coco. <laughs> yeah, you saw. And then she vanished. Vamoose. No, but she kept her distance. She knows the potential threat when she sees one. But she's not a myth. She is real. Hi, girl. What's up? Apparently she's just in love me mode too. 
Goy has been like that all day, so. It's almost like these things like me. It's weird. Who would have thunk it? Hi. Alright, I'm gonna keep playing my game now, Coco. Because we are almost at 9.30, then I'll give you all the love you want. <laughs> I'm sure she hid in fear that day. And she's down in the basement, and... I think it was... I think it was Lucky that was actually pissed off. With Goya and, like, yelling at him through the door. Josie, okay. Are you sure? I don't, didn't remember you having Josie in your house. Hey, I thought Josie uh, was in the apartment. Oh, I wish I could get to that end, but I don't want to fuck it up. Oh, well, whatever. YOLO, take chances. Data in Home of the Mushroom. One of my merchant colleagues went missing. Not good. Grr, woof woof, bow wow, bow wow, bow wow, bow -woo. Two months before Sabrina was born. Gotcha. God, I don't remember that. That's so forever ago. Deserts are hot. Best way to beat the heat is to stay still. Uh, would you like to know a secret? Sure. Ask the guy over there. Don't be a dick. Don't you know the secret? Ask the lady by the wall. Oh, you guys need to make up your mind. Oh, I thought that was the lady by the wall. Is that this lady? Ask the old man by the table. He knows it best. Oh, I think the kid in the room might know it. And you me to tell you the secret someone told me to say that the old lady knew it if anyone came to me. Is is this the old lady or is it the other one the old lady? Well, there isn't one, it's just fun trick young heroes like you. Come on, don't give me that look. Okay, I feel bad now. Got 100G. So bored, wish there were more gullible heroes around. After your cat stayed, uh, while you moved, Josie start, suddenly started marking she was not pleased. We ended up having to get her spade finally. Jesus! I didn't remember that, but I also didn't realize she wasn't spayed, because I thought she was like 11 or something. Uh, ho, 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 world famous scholar. You've come a long way, you must be curious. We're journeying to the desert temple. Do you know of it? Of course I do. Shall I tell you of it? Sure. Long ago, bandits on a treasure hunt went to the desert temple. None returned, but I've heard many rumors. A large stone monster protects the treasure. Just take my advice, stay out of the temple. Nope. I don't listen to advice. My skull is thick. I do as I want. No, I will not stay for that much. Shrewd negotiator. Just for you, 50 G. Nope. It's not easy, my friend, but because I like you, final offer, 10 G. Nope. Oh, my friend, so ruthless. How about 5 G? Yes. Sleep tight. I got I was still a teenager, can afford extra things like that. She never went outside, so it really wasn't an issue. Gotcha. Yeah, when I uh, when I adopted Goy and Coconut, it was a requirement um, of if they got adopted that we pick them up from the vet uh, where they fix them. So really didn't even have a say in it. Alright, 
time to mosey. Big sword. Big sword. Motherfucker die, motherfucker die. Come on. Come on down. Uh, like I'm trying to visually like see how to get to these the treasure chest here, but like the sand is very confusing. <laughs> Is this the way to... No, I think I need to go over more. This is the dead end, if I recall. Yeah. Alright, so let's go back up and to the right. Back and to the left. Back and to the left. On the grassy hill. <laughs> Man, I really hate the fact that if I save and I quit out, that I can't just resume where I was at. So, that's ah, kind of a bummer with modern or with this game. All kids asleep, so I'm going to do some gaming on my own. Cool. Have a good night, Pocky. Thanks for dropping in and hanging out. Papa, always appreciate the company. And I will be streaming again on Friday night. Um. Starting at roughly about 6.30, so I'll see you then, maybe. Secret to everybody. Got 100G. Ah, good old throwbacks. Follow your own path. The sign supports you. Fuck, this is not what I wanted. Okay, so how do I get to... Alright, so looking at the little map down there, I need to enter from the bottom. And then I can scoot all the way to the right if I can get down there. But I don't think I'm going to be able to make it, so let's see if I can at least find the path. change the camera because this camera is not there we go that's a little bit better for figuring out this I feel like this yeah this will take into the chest oh it's just a couple monies lame Money, this will push me here, which will push me into the middle. I have a whole lot of option here. I don't think there are any more chests. Okay, so there's a chest. So how do I that goes there, that goes there. Alright, so traveling back, boom. I need to get there. In order to get there, I need to get this. This goes there, goes there, that goes there, that goes there. Okay, I have no way of getting to that. Yes, I know, judgment galore. I don't know what I'm doing. Like, that was not the correct move. I hate puzzles like this. This is not my thing. I know, Goya, I know.
Alright, so I think I am going to call it, because I'm not going to be able to make it to the dungeon and clear the dungeon in 10 minutes. Yes, I am a negative Nelly, Nancy, Nonathan, uh, whatever you want to call it, but I do not think it's going to happen. I know, Goya, and Goya is very, very adamant that I spend more time with him. More. Uh, if you cannot hear him, he is screaming his ears off right now. My ears off, for that matter. Oh, you bastard just spurned me. Yes, yes. Sticky white stuff. Goddamn from software. Alright, so how do I... Do bombs hurt that? I don't think that works that way, does it? Oh shit, it does. I know, Goya. I'm excited too. We found a way to do something. But it doesn't actually help us, because we have... Oh, we have no way to get there. Say what? Mori is subbed for 15 months. That's a lot of months. Thank you, Mori. Thank you for your support and helping put Kibble in the bowl. Goy is very appreciative. Alright, so I'm going to save and quit out, and then I will just do my exit for tonight. Alright, so that is saved. We'll go ahead and... Wow, the music completely stopped. Oh. We've had enough of uh, the sands. So we will quit game on our ancient PS3. Go full screen. Duke. Are we? Yay, we are here. So my lighting is off today. Apologize. Um, Goya is very upset about it too, if you can tell. Um, I had to improvise because my previous lighting was broken by maybe some cats. Um, not to name names because then they'll just take it out on me tonight. Um, but we ran a good three hours tonight. Most of the jank has been worked out from not streaming for a couple of weeks. It's been a while. I apologize, but thank you for being patient, everyone. Uh, thanks again for the subs from, uh, Miss Lissa, from Pocky, and from Mori, and coming back and hanging out with me. Um, I think I should be back onto my normal routine now, so which will be Mondays and Fridays, starting at 6.30 Eastern. Usually go about three hours and change. Um, if this tomorrow wasn't something with work i'll probably go a little bit later uh figure out that desert because i was really getting, getting under me um but anyway so we will continue streaming more of this on friday uh i'd like to beat it at this point i am through two of six dungeons i think i saw there are eight bosses so this actually looks like it's going to be a pretty quick game maybe through this week and next week and we should be able to wrap it um i don't know where i'm going to go at for after that for gaming giant tbd on that so we'll see but hopefully we enjoy a little bit more from software in the traditional sense with 3d dot game heroes alex uh, we got a couple more sessions so other than that have a good night everyone thank you take care good night nothing goya that's what i thought